Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today I am going to be doing, yes, another review on an air purifier. This one is from It Vanilla. I have done one review on one of their products before and I gave it about, you know, three out of five stars. This one I'm getting ready to go ahead and do another review on. I do like this one because off the top because it is black and it looks a little bit more sleek and less commercially than the white ones that I have um, received. So I am looking forward to going ahead and reviewing this one. This is the iGrove model AP-A1. And so, yeah, let's go ahead and see how this works. This one has a three-in-one filtration system. It's whisper quiet. It also has a child safety lock and a comfortable LED night light. So, all right, I'm going to go ahead and take it out and test it out and see how it works. So this is fresh out of the box and I have turned it upside down because I'm pretty aware that these have to have the plastic removed off of the filter before they get used. So all I did was turn it over and then I popped this out and I'm about to go ahead and peel this plastic off if I can get it off and then start operating it. So basically all it is is that the, you know there's a lock and an open you just twist it to the open side and then you just kind of get down in here it's hard for me to do it with one hand so i'm going to go ahead and take this filter off and go ahead and plug it in really i do like it i did say it was black but this is more like a charcoal it's really sleek i do like the way this one looks better than the other ones that i have received so i really hope that it works just as good or even better than the um, other ones that I have uh, done a review on and everything so we shall see so I've taken the plastic off of the filter and if you can see it's got those little black charcoal so it's a charcoal filtration system in this honeycomb like filter and when you take the plastic off you just want to make sure that you put it back down in it like this and this makes it easy these pull tabs right here once you get the plastic off and you can get this out these make it easy to actually change the filters. And from my experience, changing the filters is probably necessary like every six to, about every six weeks on these because they're not that big and if you keep them running as often as I do, you're probably gonna need to change the filter that often. So we're gonna go ahead and plug it up. So it comes with this cord right here. So I'm gonna find where it goes. I'm assuming it goes right here in this little slot. And I'm gonna plug it up and let you guys see how it sounds. So I currently have mine set up in the kitchen. I usually like to use my ear purifiers in the kitchen to rid of food smells. I cook with a lot of garlic and, you know, sometimes it gets really rank in here and it's not so fresh. So, I mean, look, the hints, there's a garlic bulb right there. I have garlic all the time in the house. So I am going to turn it on. Let me pull it out here from, and I don't mind this actually sitting on my counter next to my KitchenAid. My KitchenAid is so pretty and she doesn't even hardly get used that much. So... I'm going to go ahead and, you know, turn it on. But I, like I was saying, I do like the way that it looks on the counter right here. It's not going to bother me so much sitting here, but I do have to take some of my other crap off of the counter as well. So let's see. So the top of the counter. So here is the on off switch. Let's turn it on. Right now it is on. Sounds like nighttime mode. Very quiet, you can't even hear it. Let's go to the next speed. Can you guys hear that? It's very, very quiet. And here's the highest speed. So even at the high speed, it's not very loud. Listen. And that might even work for somebody if you need nighttime noise. So it can maybe uh, do two things at once. Kill two birds with one stone. Maybe you need some white noise and you need to purify your air in the bedroom. So that's a good thing. So I do like that it's very quiet. And then obviously it has the filter reset. So whenever you need a new filter, this light will shine up. And then here you have the LED light that comes on. So there you go. So... I will read the instructions and figure out how to do the child safety lock. I don't have any children, so that's not 
not only small children that live here with me. So I will figure that out. I, it's not necessary for me because what's the point? But if you guys want to know, I'll figure that out. So I'm going to go ahead and let this run. And I actually did do some cooking this morning. I'm on my way off to the gym. Maybe I'll actually even come back and let you know if some of the smells from the turkey bacon are out of the air. So, so far, I like it. I'm impressed with just the sleek look of it and how quiet it is. So, I'll be back. Okay, y'all. So, I am back from the gym, and I've been gone for about two hours. I took a shower, came back in, but the first thing that I noticed when I came back in the house is that I did not smell any remnants of what I was cooking for breakfast this morning, and that was turkey bacon and some scrambled eggs, and yeah. So, I'm going to go ahead and give my review so far on the Ed Vanilla Air Purifier. So, let's go in here and take a look. Okay, so I had it on the highest speed right here. So I had it on the highest speed for about two hours, and there's actually nothing in the air. Now, the last air purifier review that I did, you guys know that because I said that our kitchen here, I'll put this here. Um, our kitchen is pretty much open concept, so. It didn't, it wasn't really good for a space like this. It was more for like smaller rooms. This one, even though I don't think this one is really meant for larger rooms, but it does seem to work better than the other one. My battery died, so I had to go get my uh, other phone. Uh, actually, I had to go get my phone to record because I don't um, want to use my big camera. But anyway, uh, even though all I cooked was breakfast food, and breakfast food doesn't really tend to linger that long in the air. It's not like fish or garlic or something really strong or frying foods. It's not like that. But typically, it takes a good couple of hours. Uh, you know, so I would say usually by noon, you wouldn't be able to tell what I cooked for breakfast or anything like that. But this, I don't smell anything in the air whatsoever. Now, uh, this, I believe, is good for up to 150 square feet. In your home and I would recommend still putting it in a closed off room for you to actually actually maximize the effect of the air purifier but overall, overall if I were to give this on a scale of 1 to 10 a rating I would probably give this a good 7 the only reason that I'm not giving it higher than a 7 and really I probably still probably do like about 6.5 or 7 I'm not giving it higher than that because again these are more for smaller rooms i would love to be able to review an air purifier that works more for larger spaces but i guess they're gonna be like boo boo you're gonna have to pay for those you know we'll give you a discount but you're gonna have to buy one and do a review on your own and that's exactly what i might do but i got all these little ones i'm just gonna hook them all up and they're gonna all do the trick for me <laughs> so um yeah so anyway guys if you are interested in getting an air purifier for your home one that's a little bit better than some of the other ones that I have reviewed, definitely go ahead and check out the description box. I'll leave all of the information for this air purifier in that description box below. Again, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do that. And stay tuned to the channel because this channel has all kinds of stuff going on. Vlogs, hauls. I got vlogs, hauls. Not vlogs, hauls. I got vlogs, hauls, cling with me, uh, and stuff. <laughs> but anyway, bye y'all. Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all later.